So for the interlude and verse, you only need four chords. The first one is D minor. You take your index, first string, first fret, middle finger, third string, second fret, pinky, second string, third fret. After that, A minor. Index, second string, first fret, middle finger, fourth string, second fret, ring finger, third string, second fret. G minor. Your index bars all of the strings on the third fret, ring finger, fifth string, fifth fret, pinky, fourth string, fifth fret. And A minor. We play each chord for two counts, and the strumming pattern is down, down, up. One, two, one, two, one, two. Down, down, up, down, down, up. So it looks like this. One, two, one, two, one. Interlude and verse. After that, we have the chorus. We only need two chords, G minor and a new chord, C major. You take your index, second string, first fret, middle finger, fourth string, second fret, ring finger, fifth string, third fret. For the chorus, we play each chord for four counts. So our strumming pattern is down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Da, 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 da. One, two, three, four. So it looks like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Just play that eight times, and that's basically the whole song. And when you're done, the last chord you play to end this song is a D minor. That's it, no vacation, love fool.